with the lease agreement in jeopardy. Local business owners here in Stewart are speaking out and showing up, hoping Monday night's vote isn't a step back. <laughs> Following mixed reviews from city commissioners and residents, the current lease agreement is up for debate. That's because the latest agreement states the county and the city would split the first $30 million spent on designing and developing the station, and it would fall on the city to pick up any additional costs. At recent meetings, there was a lot of back and forth between the city commissioners and the mayor. One commissioner saying it's a terrible deal for taxpayers, going on to say Brightline shouldn't have this little town fund its 32 $50 million station, but some disagree, telling me they know it's a big investment and taxpayers will feel the cost, but think it's a step in the right direction for the city. We'll be live outside City Hall with the latest tonight at 5 and 6, but for now in Stewart, Rachel Perry, WPBF 25 News.